hey y'all welcome back um if you're new here i'm aisha you're welcome please hit the subscribe button if you haven't done that already um today i'm going to be talking about universities in istanbul or university in, universities in turkey that accept um international students and have english um programs for international students both um undergraduates um postgraduate students so um this is not all of it of course there are so many universities here and definitely many universities that accept international students but these are the ones that go through and um i really wished i could share you know like the tuition fees of these universities or maybe where the tuition begins but i was not able to find that on the um, websites to go through all that you have to um go to the application side and everything and i wasn't applying for any of the schools so it was not really easy for me to um to get like the actual fee um fee range for the different programs so the good thing about these websites or these universities that i'm going to be telling you about or these universities i'm going to be saying is basically because on the websites they have the english and the turkish um language translation things so that if you do not understand turkish if you actually are looking forward to applying then you can have the english option but and and, and you can see their fees range if you try to apply but i wasn't applying so it wasn't easy for me to see the fees range so you can go ahead and um check the websites i'm going to leave the websites in the description box so that you can see for yourself so i'm just going to go straight into it and um, call the names of the universities with english programs for postgraduates and undergraduate studies and um also they have the english translation page on their website because some, some universities here in turkey do not have the translation page everything is in turkey so you are going to be able to get more information if you visit their websites okay so let's get into it. so um these universities are in no particular order it's just according to the university like according to the sites that i visited it's no particular order but all of them be sure they accept um english no not just english but international students because they have arabic and probably other languages i don't know but they, but they accept international students from you know wherever so the first university i'm sorry if i'm looking down i wrote them down the first university is um istanbul technical university um it's here in istanbul of course and it's not only limited to technical studies from what i found out um the second university is um id istanbul id university that one is very popular among um, african students they have a good number of african students and most african students schooling here in turkey are in this particular university as well as istanbul gelishim university that is the university that i go to istanbul gelishim university um istanbul gelishim and id they are very popular amongst black students uh african international students um cyprus international university well this one is not in istanbul but it is um also considered a very popular university when you're looking for universities in turkey because northern cyprus is under um turkey at the moment so um you would always find cyprus universities among turkish universities if you're looking for turkish universities because also in northern cyprus they um they speak turkish so it's like the same thing it's like the same country but it's different countries i don't know the history of the whole thing but that's how it is so Inter um cyprus international university is also very popular with um with international students and especially black students i know a couple of people who went there for their um, undergraduate studies and then came to istanbul for their um, postgraduate study um from what i know about cyprus northern cyprus precisely you do not need a visa i think what you need is an e-visa or they give visas at the airport when you arrive i'm not very sure but i'll look for that information for you guys in a later video and i'm going to tell you people about that but yeah and then you have um istanbul university it's a very old university it's a public um public university but it's also um accepting or accepts international students 
from wherever they also have programs in english so um yeah that's istanbul university next university is bacheche university they also accept international students i don't know much about their english courses but they do accept international students um you have near east university that's also in cyprus you have um i think it's is it eastern mediterranean university it's also in cyprus those two those two universities are in cyprus and for eastern mediterranean university what i understand is you have to pay um you have to pay your full fees for the first semester if you're a new student if you're applying for the first time you have to pay your full fees for one semester you know how in other universities you pay um, your deposit you pay some small amount first for the first semester in this school if you're a new sit um a new <laughs> if you're a new um student you have to pay everything for the first semester and then maybe you can start paying in installments for the second semester but that's how eastern mediterranean university in cyprus goes so the next university we have in turkey in istanbul is um the mamara university it's here in istanbul and they also accept international students i'm going to leave all the links of these um different universities in the description box so please check the description box for all the universities that i'm going to mention or have mentioned um for the the website so that you can check because you guys ask a lot about universities and studying here and i just felt like i should do this video to you know help some of you get clarity or the answers that you've been looking for so the next university is um bacon university bacon university is also here in istanbul actually is so close to where i stay i always pass by it when i'm coming back to the house um it's it's a nice university from the outside i don't know about the inside because that's not where i go so yeah but <laughs> it's a nice university and good thing they also accept english um they have english courses or english programs and they accept international students and then um, last but not the least is okan i don't know if it's okon i don't know how to pronounce it but i i'm just going to pronounce it the way i see it it's okan university they also accept international students and they have english programs now mind you i don't know the different english programs that they have because for my university the english programs are kind of limited and um for example when i first came i wanted to do law but they do not have law programs in english but i think in cyprus they have law they have ll llb which is like bachelor's in law or something of that sort they have it in cyprus i'm not sure which particular university in cyprus but they have that in some cyprus universities yeah i don't know if other universities offer that so that's just an example like there are limited courses in english so you might want to study something in english but it's not available in english rather it's available in turkish but there is something else that's available in english so all of these schools offer different programs in english it is not a standard it's not standard program um, so we'll come to the end of this video and i hope you guys enjoyed watching i definitely enjoy sharing this with you guys i've actually been going through all this um for the past days trying to put the universities together because there are so many universities but these are like the ones that i just chose randomly and especially because it's also in istanbul um i might do another video for um you know universities in turkey you know maybe not limited to istanbul so let me know in this um let me know excuse me let me know in the comment section if you want to know about other universities in different cities in turkey not limiting to istanbul because of course there are many many universities and there are international students in different universities in istanbul not only um, in, in turkey not only not only in istanbul so let me know if you want to see another video like that and i'm going to do it so yeah I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm going to do another video next week. So stay tuned. Next week, I'm going to be talking about videos, um, universities that have um, universities with low tuition fees for international students. That's universities that are not very expensive um, for international students. So stay tuned for next week. I'm going to do that video and um, 
yeah i'll see you guys next week i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video please give it a thumbs up if you did and let me know if you want to see more videos like this and give me your video suggestions and i'm going to do it please let me know what you want to see because sometimes i get stuck and i just need ideas from you guys so let me know what you want and let me know um what questions you want me to answer and i'm going to do a video dedicated to them the ones that i can <laughs> so I'll, I'll see you guys in my next video subscribe if you haven't and um <laughs>